Uh, and Dave, you say you don't follow hockey. You like boxing or MMA type stuff? Both. I'm say? just a big fight fan. I love yeah, boxing. Yeah. I yeah, I'm a huge boxing. fight fan. Yeah, yeah it's uh, that's a dying thing. Do you, you think that yeah. can make a comeback? Not in Latin America. I mean, in theory, you know, we've got yeah. 50 Cent, and those people are getting into it. If you're able to sort of get and you know engage a younger demographic, it might have a life. Yeah, you need a guy. You need a hip hop yeah. guy. That's right. I that, think MMA is where it's at, though, man. Oh MMA yeah, it's great, is but it's only so... it's where it's at because they're making fights that are really competitive. They don't have to have a 20 and 0 record in order to get an important fight. If you got to yeah. do that in boxing, you just choke it. Plus, it seems like boxing never fixed itself. Like it's had so many opportunities for. So Someone to come in and make it less corrupt. All it seems those different corrupt. entities. There's no commission. Yeah, it you know? seems as corrupt as ever. It's and like it, trying to unionize comedy. I mean, <laughs> and it does seem as corrupt as ever. You know, you've got all these personalities that have, you know, That'd terrible be a funny Dark yeah. comedy trying to unionize trying comedians. To unionize comedy. <laughs> <laughs> every every meeting's hilarious, yeah. but just nothing yeah. gets done. Everybody's working against their own best interest because of their childhood. <laughs> no, we're not. We're not for each other. Yeah, yeah exactly. Uh -huh. We're the direct opposite. Yeah. Of all you got to do is sign this piece of paper, and you'll make twice as much. My father never signed papers. <laughs> yeah. It's a mess. Hey, Bichetti. What part? Uh, what part of uh, LA do you live in? I live in Venice. You're like, well, that's nice. At least. It is. If you gotta live in LA, it's nice yeah. to live in a place where you can walk a little bit. Yeah, you know? yeah, no, that's nice at least to live by, by yeah. the water. Hey, if you, whenever you get a chance to live by water, I always take that. Yeah. Even here, I live by the Hudson River, and the, yeah. you know, I just like looking at oh, it. Oh, it's beautiful. It's man. peaceful. Yeah. And what are the broads like in Venice? Yeah. They're nice, huh? They're a lot like the ones in the Hudson River. <laughs> <laughs> dead from testifying? Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> just, 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 just dead fish eyes from living in L.A. in the first place. <laughs> Cold they're, and they're wet. Souls. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cold and well, wet. Well, mine, mine are just cold. But uh, <laughs> yeah. no, they, 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 they oh, just no, have no it's soul good. left. It's fine. I mean, it's, I think, you know. Are you buddies with my friend Brian Callen, right? You know Brian. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, Brian. Brian's one of my close, yeah, close we've, friends. We've discussed yeah. you. Uh, yeah, yeah. We were both fans of your stand-up. Oh, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, Brian. Yeah, so what? Uh, yeah, yeah, but it's funny. You know, but Brian, Brian, you talk about happiness. He was born with a higher set point no, than he, other people. Yeah, he was. Like, that's a typical he's an optimistic guy. guy, and he's happy regardless always, of what's going on. Always do we want to strangle him, and he's such a nice guy, you yeah. don't want to strangle him. Yeah. And then you realize he knows 18 different forms of karate. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, he was born like, uh, yeah. like uh, his father was an international finance Yeah, yeah, he grew up all around the world. He's actually Egypt. been on Hox, fox hunts and speaks fluent French. <laughs> 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 yeah. he's, an, he's an aristocrat slash comedian. We wrote a yeah. sketch. When we were on Mad TV, we wrote a sketch where he had to play the gym. Henry Gamble living with his wife, yeah. Yeah. and the sketch was uh, he had to say, "Calm down, honey. I got fifty grand on a Notre Dame game." Yeah. And he said, "Notre Dame in the read through." <laughs> 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 I got fifty grand on the Notre Dame. Everybody's like, "What it's are you so doing? Yeah. Goes, what are you yeah. doing? What yeah. am I doing?" Yeah. 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 Come on, just goof, goof around. The same. Yeah. Right. Uh, I am saying right. I was Notre at a bar. <laughs> 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 Somebody was passing around wine, and Brian's like, "No, I don't drink anything that isn't French." But he didn't say it to put on an air. <laughs> <laughs> it just never occurred to him that not drinking old <laughs> French wine isn't French. Yeah. No, that's something yeah. where you want to strangle the guy, and you go, "Really? Yeah, yeah, no." But he's he really not. doesn't do anything. Yeah. No, he's the greatest guy, sweetheart. Yeah, um, yeah. I just had him in here. I hadn't seen him in a while. Like we did the first two years of Man TV, and he yeah. had a kid. And I'm yeah. like, "How are you evolving? Like, like that's, that's unbelievable." Like I see people... having a kid isn't synonymous with evolving. Yeah, but, yeah. I know, but to me it is. I guess I, I think you're right, though. It isn't. As a matter of fact, it's a lot no. of times the direct opposite. Yeah, sometimes true. you know. But uh, I I see people walking down the street laughing. I'm like, yeah. I feel like pulling them aside. Like, what are you so happy about? Like, what's going the on? The grass is always greener, though. Man. I always say, when I see a really happy couple that's been together for longer than a year and a half, I want to give them a lie detector test. I'm like, how did you, what, are you really, are you serious? Right. But at least really? they're good at that. Are you serious? At least they can be consistent with the lying, though. Like, I couldn't keep that yeah. up. Yeah, and you know? uh, maybe, uh, yeah, I don't know, man. I, I, you but know, then your soul, right? soul dies quicker. If you, you lie to it, yeah, yeah. Marty, you stuff it down. You guys, yeah. what you're talking about is self-deception. And, and the uh, key, thanks, Mr. Raider. Uh, the key, Sigmund, Sigmund Freud, yeah. Jack Tatum over here. <laughs> hey, I took some psych classes before. Yeah. Uh, and the key, the key to what you do, comedy, is not self-deceiving yourselves. I mean, drawing attention to the reality of situations. I think it'd be weird if I just started melting down and admit that I'm a homosexual. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're so right and really yeah, attractive. You, you know, John, you know, John, you're right. I want to make out with you too. <laughs> yeah. I know it happens. Yeah. That happens did sound a, a little Scott Thorsony. Yeah, well, I can't wait to meet him. Well, that's going to be fun. I I agree. Now, what about now? Why don't you get honest and stop denying the energy that we, that we share every time we make eye contact? Why don't you get honest about that? Ever since I walk in this room, you haven't taken your eyes off my calves. Yeah, Boschetti. Now, Boschetti is the classic Staten Island homophobe, though. Now, yeah. now, do you feel, John, is he being sensitive or are you uncomfortable? 
No, John's just a good go-around guy. It's like a, an American hero to me. He's a cool guy. <laughs> He's an American he's hero? So yeah, kind, yeah. Man. Well, that took a, that went to another level. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That, yeah. yeah. How is he an American? I mean, I like John, too. Let's but, just uh, leave it at well, that. He, he just, like, no, let's not. Let's delve into this. <laughs> <laughs> he just like gives people the benefit of the doubt. That's what I love about him. He sounds like uh, a jerk. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it, it's amazing the degree to which he's lowered the bar of the term hero. <laughs> <laughs> he gives people the benefit of the doubt. You know, it's a hero, the guy at the bagel shop across the street, and also the cameraman, and these three guys over here. Yeah, you My mother's to, a hero, too. To be a hero, you just have to be Nelson Mandela. <laughs> yeah, I thought you had to, yeah, fly stand and up fight for, a for cause. civil rights. <laughs> yeah. be, be in prison for 27 years because of a cause you believe in. Now it's just like, I don't know. I, know, tell you, yeah, yeah. I trust the guy. I don't know. Yeah, he picked me up French fries. The guy's a hero. <laughs> <laughs> Mike Buschetti, <laughs> king of the low bars. <laughs> I'm looking <laughs> for a hero. Yeah. John is also a warrior. That's what I love about him. He's, yeah. But he's, but he's not... Well, you're lowering that bar, too. Did you see his last Super Bowl? <laughs> no, no, but I'm saying... But <laughs> yeah. No, but he's he's a not, warrior. Let's not judge it. And he's even in the game. No, you'll love this. Put up the picture of John uh, for Dom, man. You'll love this. This is him on the Eagles. This is this. him on the Eagles, man. Yeah. This, it's really the best. It's uh, This is Warrior. This is Braveheart type stuff. It takes a few minutes, but it's worthwhile. Okay. There it is. See him? Oh, good stuff, man. <laughs> that is like, I mean, that's a ball player right yeah. there. Yeah. It that's was the guy who's that yeah. grand was... That was right after he was elected Grand Dragon of the Scottish Clan. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It was a joke. That was a what joke. What do you mean no, it was a joke? Luck, what do you mean it's a joke? Because we had p pictures for the media guide. They told right? us we were taking pictures for the media guide, and I had long hair, and I thought it would be funny to cut all of it in the front yeah. and leave a mullet, yeah, a mullet. That's so what... that it would be preserved see, for think, posterity I think you that had I had a mullet. mullet. I, I think see, you had I, a mullet. I, but I didn't. It was just long. Well, it was but, all long. Thought, what do you think? Did I just didn't cut just it ever. He had a mullet. I, and that I, was... I, 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 I had that I mullet he, for a, a you're very short period You're getting litigious with the term time. mullet. I, I, think, I think that qualifies in most people's mind as a mullet. But by the way, by the way, Mike, look at a picture. No, but, that's, good, that's, but you look good. That's what you call a hero. <laughs> yeah. That's what Shetty's hero. Right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, a lot of all new hero on NBC. That was one of those things where I was laughing. A what? He's like uh, a like healer. Two different kind of. So he's Jesus warriors. Christ. A healer, warrior, no, hero. No, what I'm saying, like some warriors just devastate, and some guys yeah. like the Romans and Greeks were healers and warriors. Wow. <laughs> listen to this. By the way, listen <laughs> to this. Love that. that. Here's here's how uh, articulate Boschetti is. On yeah. these. Listen to these two uh, quotes from Boschetti on the air. Yeah. I'm getting tired of these little, these little, these little jerks in it, and I'm tired of crapping all over the place and picking up pay all day, and it's annoying me. Oh, that's good stuff, this boy. One's, but this one's better though. I know how Hollywood loves when you're in a meeting. Oh, what's it like? Oh, no, it's not like my mother. You know, whatever. I know. <laughs> <laughs> not at all.